opening another day of headlines about Kate, the Princess of Wales, and a serious allegation, the mirror breaking the news that staff at the London Clinic allegedly tried to access her medical records from her January operation. A UK privacy watchdog confirmed the BBO, the leak in the state secrets about the fucking royals, lad. We will learn about the BBO whether you like it or not. Coming to NBC News, it received a breach report and now investigating it. Kensington Palace saying this is a matter for the London Clinic. This is quite a serious breach. Even if it's someone who is just feeling a little bit nosy, they should not have been able to access her records. And for someone like the Princess of Wales, who's made it clear how much she wants to keep her privacy, this will be very alarming. Meanwhile, Prince William carrying on, and for the second time in as many weeks, mentioning Kate. But the scrutiny continues as photo agencies review past handout photos from the royal family. The Getty Photo Agency and Reuters calling into question numerous digital inconsistencies in this photo taken by Kate in August of 2022. Meanwhile, we saw King Charles drive by Buckingham Palace twice yesterday, carrying out official duties even as he undergoes cancer treatment. Subscribing to his mother's mantra. Okay, guys, yeah, of course they fucking are photoshopping photos, man. Come on. Like, that's, that's kind of stupid. Yeah, no shit, they're photoshopping photos. Like, what? Like, I kind of hate, I, I, I kind of hate this whole, what is this, the best of? Bro, I'm not watching fucking John Stewart best of right now. The what do you think's going British on with Norman? Kate Middleton? Do you think she's okay? I think she's been... Oh, when I do this, when I'm in fucking Oi Brovland, everybody yells at me. But when it's a British guy himself doing it, then it's fine. I literally did this exact same thing and chat was like, don't do that. That's rude. When I was asking people if the queen is actually dead or not. Which she very much was, by the way. Been We're asking the people of Manchester what's really going on with Kate Middleton. Let's find out. I think she had a BBL. She's recovering. Yeah. She's in recovery. She needs to recover. She needs her time. Yeah. Do you think she was made by AI machines? Uh, probably. Yeah, thank you, sir. Uh, who are you? I'm just a man asking <laughs> simple questions. Do you think she's healthy? She's obviously had serious surgery. I think she should be left to recover and get back to the delight that she always was. She's getting a BBL. Oh. Do you know what's happened? Did you see that photo? The photo, yeah. Yeah, she's not wearing a wedding ring in it. Do you think she might be I mean, pregnant with a lizard egg of some kind? That would be kind of c***y, actually. <laughs> she's the one photoshopping the pictures. Do you think she is? Do you think Kate Middleton's okay? No, I think I she's... Really oh, what, care. as in, is she all right? Do you think she's maybe dating Pete Davidson now? <laughs> oh, my God, no oh, way. <laughs> she almost said, I think she's a bit... I mean, uh... That's so funny. That would be kind of cool. Like, good yeah. for her. Yeah. Ten inches. <laughs> Guys, do you reckon Kate Middleton's okay? I don't know. Was she ever real? That's the question. No, probably not. Do you know what's happening with Kate Middleton, by any chance? Don't care. Don't care, thank you. We haven't found her in Manchester. Maybe we need to go down south. The journey starts here. She's a bowing whistleblower. Nice. you have to be seen to be believed back to the investigation that's pretty alarming someone trying to break into the hospital records what would come next in that investigation yeah and we're trying to get to the bottom of this we have been digging all morning like i said we've asked the hospital we have not received a comment no what happens is they kill them right a breach of the royal's privacy comes with a State royal court mandated punishment of 10 lashings, 25 jellied eel consumption, and of course, being forced to swim in the River Them 
after having 25 jelly deals with a full belly. Once the order is proceeded with, the method will be decapitation by the royal executioner. But the Mirror newspaper here did receive a comment from the hospital. It said, we firmly believe that all our patients, no matter their status, deserve total privacy and confidentiality regarding their medical information. And also this morning, you guys, the health minister was doing the media rounds, and she talked about the hefty implications for accessing notes that you don't have access to mm. without permission, including prosecution or fines. We will definitely stay on this one. Yeah, for sure. Molly, we know you will. Thank you so much. You just want her to come out and just say, hey, guys, I'm good. Yeah. Go back to your lives, right? But until then, this controversy continues. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel. Today, all I wonder why she hasn't, by the way.